the scale up of the year for a company not headquartered in Indiana is Wonderkind, a New York based company that acquired Smarter HQ in 2020 and has grown exponentially since then. Pleased to be joined backstage here at the Mirror Awards by Kara Holdhouse, who's the Vice President of Client Services at Wonderkind. And uh, Kara, congratulations. Thank you so much. Yeah. Uh, growth is a big part of your story, and I mentioned uh, how Wonderkind, again, a New York-based uh, marketing company, how it got here. So it was the acquisition of Smarter HQ. Right. Yes, in 2020, um, and that really started our growth in Indianapolis and really expansion out of New York. Uh, we're a global organization, and this is the primary focus for our growth going forward. Give us a, a kind of a thumbnail description of Wonderkind, the services you provide. Wonderkin's a performance marketing platform. Uh, we serve primarily e-commerce, retail organizations, and publishers. And we're here to personalize uh, the experience for every consumer yeah. um, throughout all of the websites you interact with. In your view, what, what is key to, to the growth? What's really driving it uh, in, in terms of what, what company, what your customers like about Wonderkin? Yeah, so we're driving uh, a lot of additional revenue for the customers that we support, but that's all through creating the best experience for you as the end consumer. Um, so we can help those brands separate their experience against their competition. Uh, but the growth uh, is really coming from the performance that our platform drives. It is above and beyond uh, all of the competition out there, and we see that as uh, a former competitor when we were a standalone Smarter HQ, and the combined solution really sets us apart um, from any of the other, uh, other options out there. You mentioned uh, your New York-based company uh, that really likes Indianapolis. So a lot of the growth, and as you look at investment, those types of things going forward are going to be, is going to be here in Indiana. Yeah, it's been interesting. Uh, really, at the time of acquisition, we were a little nervous about it, what an East Coast company might think of uh, a Midwest-based company here. And we found out, actually, a lot of our core values were exactly the same. We might have said them in different ways, um, but they're the same. And that's played through in our commitment to growing our presence here in Indianapolis. And we were around 35 uh, to 40 employees at the time of acquisition, and we've 6 x that over the last year and a half, which has been incredible to see. Yeah, and as, before we started taping, you mentioned the fact that uh, your folks from New York coming out to the Midwest, coming out to Indiana, maybe being surprised at, at what they see from a technology standpoint, and this really is a, a tech hub. Yeah, from the tech standpoint and from the talent standpoint, and being someone who's been here in Indianapolis for the last 13 years or so, uh, it's been so great to see the talent pool expand uh, and how we've been able to grow that here, and that's really set us up for the success that we've had through this acquisition. As you look going forward, opportunities for growth. Oh, I think here in Indianapolis is really where we're seeing a lot of the growth from a people standpoint, which is, I think, my most exciting piece. Maybe that's because the majority of the team here is commercially focused, um, high paying roles. Uh, and then we can really continue to help the community grow that talent uh, as we grow our company globally. Growth success story certainly taking, uh, taking place, unfolding in central Indiana, the scale up of the year for a, a non-Indiana company, Wonderkind, Kara Holdhouse, VP of Client uh, Services. And Kara, congratulations on the award. Good luck going forward. Thanks so much, Joe. All right.